How bad is alcohol for your health? So toxic, can, can, first of all. Yeah, he can think it right now, but yeah. in Singapore, it's a toxin. Yeah, well, so a couple. this is how I describe alcohol. Because, look, I'm not here to tell you not to drink, right? right? Uh, uh, but I am here to tell you the mechanics of drinking. Like, because here's how I like to say it, okay? People should know. Well, first of all, I mean, if you're trying to get in shape, I mean, drinking alcohol, whether it's liquor or beer or wine, it's like eating a Snickers bar. I mean, it turns into sugar, period. So you'll get in shape. Right? Yeah, so just from that perspective, you want to have a six-pack and you're drinking, good luck with that. I mean, I think that everybody in this room and everybody watching, like, they probably had their first alcoholic beverage when they were what? In their single digits. Eight, nine, ten years old. We were watching our parents. What is this stuff? But, I mean, I think everybody in this room would agree the first time that you tasted any of these three, whether it was wine, liquor, or beer, you grimaced your face. A hundred percent. You're like, what the? Right? <laughs> why are we drinking? Why are, you, why are they doing this? Right. And so the, it's funny because then we become adults and they say, well, it's an acquired taste. Well, how do we acquire something that tastes like crap? Right. Right. Well, it's very simple. Your brain starts to associate how you feel with the taste. Now, the question then becomes, well, what is this euphoric feeling that we get when we drink? Well, it's very simple. When you imbibe poison, the body has one mechanism to actually respond to that.